Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got another one of my birthday gifts to share. I've told y'all before, <clears throat> every dime that comes my way, if it's a birthday gift, a Mother's Day, Christmas, gift card, bonus at work, y'all, I'm spending it on nail stuff. And this is one of my things that I got this year. Now, you guys know I don't do gel polish much. I don't do it um, often at all. But part of that is the removal. Um, and let's say I use a peel-off face coat, you know, um, I really just don't want to mess with it because I, I like to change mine out too often. So I bought me this Vogue Professional, my manicurist, professional drill. This is an e-file. And I did a lot of research. I watched just a ton, ton of videos on the YouTube. And, and this is the one I finally decided to get. Now, you can buy little nail files for, you know, next to nothing. And, um, you know, they may or may not work. I don't know. I, I've, I've, I've read so many articles. Some of them are just junk straight out of the boxes. But I did a lot of research. And I decided on this one. Because I don't have a need for it every day. I didn't, I didn't need like the $250 or the $800 one. You know, I watched Susie's nail, nail career education. And, I mean, they get up into, you know, almost $1,000. And I so don't need that because I'm not going to be using it that often. But I wanted a good one. In case I have a friend come over that's got on acrylics or hard gel. And we want to buff. Okay, so let's get this box out of the way. I we're tired of staring at the box to you. Okay, so it came in that cool box that had styrofoam, not styrofoam, like the, um, you know, foam cut out indentions where every single piece went all nice and snug. Nothing was jiggling around. It came with an adapter. Gorgeous, beautiful. <laughs> and then it came with the, the actual e-file part. And you hold it like a pen. It's got the little, you know, place where you put your different tips in and it plugs in along with that and this feels it's not too heavy and it's not too I mean you know it's not uncomfortable for me um, it's like holding a, what, a highlighter or something you know one of those fat highlighters and here is the little machine itself so you've got like a little well here that you would you know lay your file in um, I really, really like it. I love it. It's got the little rubbing knob so that it doesn't just fall out or slide out if it got bumped. I'm going to flip it up so you can see. There's the speed control, and here's where you plug in. It's got forward and reverse, which is really nice in case you're right or left-handed. You know, you can turn it different ways depending on whether you're right or left-handed. And then an on-off switch, and I like that all of that's on the front and easy to get to. Got some nice little rubbery wheels on the bottom wheels, knobs, to keep it from shot vibrating around on your desk. Like I said, I'm not planning on using this like just a ton. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I really wanted to have something because I do not want to have to be, let me grab one and show you. I do not want to have to be taking off hard gel or something with this back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back No, none of that. I don't want none of that. Plus, truth be told, let me get back here to you. Truth be told, I'm going to be doing a review on a product that I've been sitting on for about a month. And I've been sitting on it because I didn't want to put it on my nails and then be freaking out, not able to get it off. I'll just be straight up honest about it. That product is all over the internet right now. I'm sure you've seen it. But I've got some of this gel-like poly gel. And I've got the little tool and I got the poppets and I'm ready to go. My interest in this product is um, in case my nails are all looking really, really good and I have a break, then I could go in and put some poly gel on a poppet, put it on my finger, cure it, file it down, buff it up, and it'll look like my other nails. It won't stand out like a sore thumb, like a broke nail. That's my interest in this. This is coming very, very, very soon. 
one of the very next videos I plan on recording. So just to let you know why this came into play. That's, that's just where we're going. I'll just want to let you know. Um, <laughs> I'm very excited about it. I also have had friends that like, they want me to do their nails, but they're like, oh, well, when mine grow out, I'll come over and let you paint my nails. And I'm thinking, are you kidding? Yeah, when I first started painting my nails, I had like nothing. There wasn't even no free edge to cap. So, um, but by keeping polish on, you know, they're here now. That has nothing to do with the machine. Sorry. But, like I said, I, there's there was a reason for this. And, and I just didn't want y'all thinking, oh, she's fixing to go off into acrylic world and just get lost. My main passion is my natural nails regular nail polish because this girl likes to change out her polish often but i like to have options and um and i like sharing the things i'm finding out there with you the consumer because y'all are consumers just like me and um when i find a good deal i'm gonna let you guys know about it okay like i said earlier these machines can run from in fact i think this one retails at like 116 or more. I can't remember what all I read. I read so much. It's a wonder my brain still works. But I got this one off of either, I think it was eBay. I'll leave a link down below. I got it for $26. Are you kidding me? Uh, yes, yeah, yeah, uh -huh, $26. This one got really good reviews. It's not top of the line. But if you're like me, this would be perfect for you. Once I use it, I will definitely give you my thoughts on it and, um, you know, keep you informed. That way you know as much as I know. <laughs> so, Cotton has come in to say hello to everyone. Cotton, are you saying hello? You gonna say hello? He's not talking, but he's looking. He's winking at y'all. So that is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this. Um, if you have an e-file, let me know what kinds you have and, and if you've got any tips for it. Um, oh, a stinker. Look, it came with these bits too. I'm losing my mind. Now these I hear are junk, so I will be purchasing better bits. Um, these are just, you know, kind of run-of-the-mill, whatever, whatever. So we will be buying some better bits to, you know, to make. I've seen some on some of the girls' channels that are just really nice. I want to find ones that, you know, I can get up close around the cuticles and stuff without worrying about, you know, chewing half my finger off. So we will, we will definitely keep you updated. And just in case you do run out and look for this one, this is the Vogue. It comes with a warranty and instructions. So, you know, there you have it, sports fans. So I will see you next time. And if I hadn't already said it, until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.